Well, I'm Rangy Kookie. Today is camp lockdown. What's that, Ranger Kooky? Well, that means I'm going to go to my camp and just lock it down. I'm gonna put everything up, hide everything, because my camping season is now over with for this season. Until it starts getting cold, while well, I can enjoy the woods. I don't like to be out here in the heat. Some of y'all might agree. Some of y'all are oh, just a pussy. You know, some states get in the hundreds plus the humidity will feel like it's in the double, triple digits. And it gets real hot out here. So what I want to do is just go to my camp and make sure everything's peeled up nice and tidy, closed, and just hidden. And I will come out here during the nice days. It's not going to complete close the season down. It's just mosquitoes, horse flies, and other nasty creatures to like to pick at your eyeballs. When you're out here, we'll be out here. So I'm just going to lock everything down, put everything up where it belongs, and just wait for the right time. Listen to the weather saying it's going to be this hot tonight. And I will come out here. I will come out here and check my game cams and just check the camp. Time to time. Maybe once a week like I've been doing. Or sometimes. That's new. Just to check it out. And make sure everything's okay. Oh, a new pine tree fell down. Damn. Willowmaker. It don't have to be an old tree to all the fall. That was a new one. I wonder why it fell. Let's check the end. I wonder how it fell or why it fell. Damn it, it's blocking my trail. I got stuff all over my hand now. <laughs> yeah, shows you how far I've been coming through this trail. It fell because of the rain and this lack of root system. That's sand. You know what that means water nearby so I'm like I said I'm coming out here to do a aid lockdown and I will come out here maybe once a week or the weather could provide me some good good stuff right now the weather's good so I'm going out here right now to lock down my camp and to the to the weather gives me a good day or good night to come out here to adventure and have some fun. But I want to say thank you to my guest, Bear, for coming out. I do appreciate you coming down from where you at. He lives somewhere around New York. New York! New York City! 1827! Two lane! Yeah. So, my friend, traveled 900 miles 14 hours to come to the ranger cookies meet up and i just want to say thank you i hope you enjoy your gifts that you have received through the days that you are here i hope you use them and abuse them oh i missed you already bear my friend bear he likes to growl at night. Like a bear. So yeah. 
I'm going. Ooh. It takes, shows you how quick a trail can change by this growing a few branches in the trail. I almost lost it until the ribbons popped up. So thank you, Bear, for coming down. I hope you enjoyed your stay. I hope to see you in the next adventures of the Rendezvous Part 3. Hang on. 4. Part 4. If I'm not sure, because I stayed in the hammock one year, stayed in the second hammock. And the third year, I used my big 30 pole. Well, back in the day, it was 20 pole. And it grew up to 30 poles. Camping system. So, thank you, Bear, for coming down. I hope I see you in the future. And maybe a new guest, if they're not scared. Scared like a bear. Ugh. Well, I just... And I just, like I said, hope you enjoy your gifts that you received. Hope you use them and abuse them. Let the world know. So, there you go, folks. It's nice right now. It's in the 70s. <coughs> Yeah, he'll get to the <coughs> to the night. Gee, damn spiders, boy! They're everywhere. Look at that one. Ruff, 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 ruff. That was a wolfing spider. Uh, yep. Oh, another spider web. I try to avoid these guys so they can catch horse flies and bugs. But sometimes you just gotta walk into them. Ah, ah, get off of me! Oh, that was scary. Who was that scary? I hope I never see a big one like that again. That thing was on me. I screamed like a little girl. Yes, I need to come through my trails. Alright, this is swampy area. Look for snakes. Snakes no good. Check for spiders again. There's a spider here. I gotta go. I'm going right into one. Alright, I need a switch. I can't see them things. <laughs> If I just switch my way through the woods, I don't have to worry about going into any more of these critters. Yeah, it's been a while since I've been through this trail. Yep, I'm taking a long way because I just want to see if I can catch somebody out here. They could probably hear my truck coming down the road. So I took the trail instead. <sighs> and, all right, well, this is almost the end of, my, of the trail, but I'm gonna go ahead and end it a little early. So thank you once again for my guests who thought about showing, but couldn't show because of financial problems. Thank you for my guests who thought about coming down, but they couldn't do it because of other items and other obstacles in their way. You know, life happens all the time. And sometimes you got to do what you have to do for family members or for yourself. Financial. I know some of y'all could have made it within five hours to an hour. But y'all were busy. So I do appreciate those who thought about it. Alright, I'm Ranger Kooky. i see y'all next, 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 next video. Because now I'm going to be putting out all, all my bear videos, me and the bear adventures. So please enjoy them. Alright, I'm Ranger Cookie, signing out from the cookie world. Oh, what a lovely. Oh, Damn you, Spider.
spider. <sighs> Ugh. I ain't killing my knocked on his web. Damn it, another one. He's on the camera. Get off, buddy. Get off a die. Okay, where is he? Okay, he's gone. Ugh. I had a big white one on me a little while ago. That was scary as hell. All right, see y'all later. Well, well, this is what camp should look like after it's been clean. Only thing I have to do is move that ladder to inside that shed. I have picked up every piece of trash that my guest and me have left. Picked it all up. Tuck in my A-frame bed so it won't get wet. Picked up everything. Tied everything up. It's all tied up for the closing season to I come back out. And at warm or colder weather, I'll put everything that can burn in the burn trash. I picked up all and cleaned all the dishes that we had used and stored them. I dumped all the fresh water that we had so it would get stagnated. I bleached and sanitized the ice chest we used. I cleaned the table. Mm. A little bit of some junk, but I gotta clean the table. Before I leave, I'll have that table clean. The kitchen zinc, all the dishes, whoops, I forgot one. All the dishes and the zinc covered. They keep it from turning green. It turns green with the green stuff up there. Folded all the chairs and put them beneath the thing, like discarded trash. So people won't say, oh, that must be trash. And organized and clean the storage shed and put the last pencil up put all the dishes that we used up so that's it I made sure everything's tied up and hidden especially the most suspensive stuff I have out here all hidden Go for it. I mean, you can try. I got like a hundred buckets. And I notice it's more cleaner right here. I took away the kitchen zinks and put them up. I have to get rid of those two bags and those two buckets. But it's fine for where it's at now. So that's the lockup or lockdown of camp. And I have to say goodbye to the camp. Goodbye. See you next season there, Mr. Camp.